I love hair and makeup. I love spray tans. When the hair and makeup is done and the spray tan is right, it's she's already she's on her way to success. I think the walk, it's simple, it's regal, it's just like walking on water. It's effortless. So Jane, you're gonna come on the stage with your bag. My name is Michael Galanis. I am a pageant director, friend, mentor, coach, and uh, the queen of everything, actually. Hold up the skates like, I figure skates. I'm a skater. Are you more like Nancy Kerrigan or Tanya Harding? I don't know. We're gonna call you Nancy Kerrigan because she was kind. From the minute they see you, you gotta be right here and on and really give it to them. So the skates are kind of hanging here. In one week, I'm hosting a pageant called Little Miss Perfect. So I'll open my doors to anyone who needs my advice. Circle around the bag and tip up. I figure out in looking at a girl, what she needed to do, her hairstyle, makeup, and what she needed to become ultimately to win the title. Bigger smile, Miss Jane. That's a good smile. That's a weird smile. <laughs> it was this innate gift that I had, and it didn't um, even need to be nourished. It was just ever present from day one. What are you doing there? Bat your lashes, bat your lashes, hold it down. Michael's never once given us anything to do that has strayed us in the wrong way or in a bad way. The moms think I'm God, pretty much, and they bow to me regularly until they lose, and then I'm the devil. So she'd pull up her nylons and then pop it up. Mr. Michael, he um, gave us like some instructions how to do the Marilyn Monroe. Let's do a big high five on that ain't right. <laughs> Let's say that ain't right together. That ain't right. Two snaps and work, girl. And say hello to the self-proclaimed queen of everything, pageant director Michael Galanis. It's the pageant where every little girl gets to define perfect. But really, in the pageants that we run, the hair and the makeup is such a small, small, small component. These pageants are the catalyst to better living. I, I'm not for negotiating with a five-year-old. Jane does not get to make the decision when her coach and mentor is telling you otherwise. Yes, but see, ne I, no. This is a stage performance, and Jane's not in charge of costumes. You know, she just loves the dress, and, and she just wants to spend every... If you're willing to sacrifice getting a lower score so that Jane feels good, then I say go for it. I can lead the young ladies to the crown, but I can't, you know, make them wear it. Round of applause, your top ten finalists for the title of Miss Perfect pageant where all your dreams come true. Little Miss Perfect pageant where the special one is you. The secret of tomorrow is to live your dreams today. The memories and the friendships, they'll never go. You want it, and you dream it, live it, today's the start, just feel it in your heart. Ladies and gentlemen, Little Miss Perfect, Music City! So I'll open my doors to anyone competing to make certain they're at the top of their game. So it's Yankee Doodle Dandy. Yes. Um, that bores me. I wish you would have called. It's very boring. God gives us all gifts. What we need to do is find a pageant mentor, which is myself or somebody great. Sometimes the little girl and family needs to be told what the gift is and then hone in on that gift. So why don't we play it up to Absolutely. be... Absolutely. Like, just give give it some wow factor. Let's think of what, um, she at the when she's at the end of the runway, let me hear you sing it, Jane. Hands come down, on. Jane, T-stop. No time to be shy, push up. She's gonna come out as a chimney sweep. Sweep, sweep, sweep. She's the chimney sweep. And then she leaves the stage, comes back out as the red, white, and blue girl. And then she comes down here. Uh -huh. That's when she'll do her Yankee Doodle went to town riding on a pony. Stuck a feather in his hat and called it. And you could say called it macaroni. How are you doing? Life is good. You're up, or should I wake you up? 
Should I spin you around? <laughs> Wake up! <laughs> when a child comes on stage and the first thing the judges notice are her teeth, newsflash, too much. Little Miss Perfect is the total package. She's the little girl that has it all. And she shines on stage. And when she exits the stage, you wish she'd had a couple more minutes to perform. Watch the show. It's a really unbiased documentary on the shows, their relationship with their mom, their involvement with the pageants, and then life after.